Hey, what's going on, y'all? So, occasionally I will stop in Goodwill, you know, to look for Star Wars toys. You know, you never know what you might find. You know, you might find something really cool. So I was there the other day, and I came across this old toy uh, Stormtrooper blaster, sort of. It's, it's supposed to be like an E-11. Uh, but the paint was weird. It was beige, had some orange. Um, yeah, here's a picture of it. It's just kind of goofy looking. And here's another picture of it. It's got the Imperial logo on there. And I don't know. You know, not the most attractive looking thing. Uh, but it was 99 cents. I figured, you know, I have plans for this little pistol or blaster. <laughs> For 99 cents and it's Star Wars it had a date written on it 1996 Lucasfilm yeah, so it's an old toy uh, but I got it home and painted it and painted it some more painted it some more and that's what it looks like now that's the same pistol so I hit it with about four coats of like a flat black and then hit it with a couple of coats of like a semi-gloss enamel and then I had to hand paint that most of them are silver right there that I've seen and then added a little bit of color in there and there and along here I know it's hard to see in this light but just to kind of give it a little bit of different shading in there. But yeah, written right there. I know it's going to be impossible to see on camera, but it says 1996 Lucasfilm Limited. And it's got some other stuff I can't read now because it's been painted. But I think it turned out pretty good. I mean, it's an E11. The only thing it's missing is the folding stock that hooks in right here and folds under. And the stock part, you know, usually you see it sitting right underneath the barrel. That's the only thing it doesn't have. And it wasn't there to begin with. This is how they marketed you know, that particular blaster. But I saw it for 99 cents. I said, I have an idea you know, of, of what I can do with that. But yeah, same pistol. I think it turned out pretty good. And I'm just going to put it somewhere over there with my little, my humble Star Wars collection back there. But yeah, I just wanted to share this. I think it turned out pretty good. The scope's kind of silly looking, but you know, it's there. The barrel, there was another cap here that I took off and just painted the inside of the barrel. But yeah, that's, it, it's basically an E11. You know, just minus the folding stock. And I think on most of them, there's like a little, like a little thing here that you could add a strap to if you want to. I'm almost tempted to go to Home Depot and see if I can find something like that. Just to screw in, just to have it hanging off the back. I don't know, it's an idea. But yeah, a 99 cent Goodwill toy Stormtrooper blaster from 1996 with a goofy paint job. And this is the end result. I think it turned out pretty good. I'm pretty pleased. Yeah, not too bad. Anyway. Just wanted to share. So if you're into Star Wars toy collecting or if you want to you know, customize something, stop by Goodwill. You never know what you might come across. Anyway, that's all I got. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you guys next time.